Have you not finished this yet? No, checking the tension. You're watching a craftsman at work here, mate, not some grease monkey. Speaking of grease monkeys, where is Ross? I don't recall that. Who made you out of HR? Right, if you're after more money, you can forget it. Oh, it's definitely not that. Is uh, Deb's about her? Yeah, we're playing hide and seek. Why? I suppose you'll find out soon enough. She's uh, giving me my old job back. So does this mean Ross is out now, then? Why are you asking me? Brew? Yeah. Hey, thanks for giving us some space last night. So how are you getting on, you and Kane? Fine. Now that he's seen sense and agreed we need a holiday. I need to get back to work, so if you want to say something. I don't think Kane's been looking too good recently, do you? Well, I know he's been moodier than usual, but we're both knackered. That's why we need this holiday. I don't think you should fly, Moira. I'm sorry, you've lost me. OK, so he's got a swelling in his brain. What are you saying? What kind of swelling? Like a tumour, you no, mean? No, it's an aneurysm. You better not be playing with me here. Oh, Moira, I wish I was. No, no, you must have got it wrong, because you would have told me. I found him collapsed at the garage. When? A couple of days ago, he was coming round. And neither of you thought of telling me. Well, I forced him to go to the hospital. And they found an aneurysm? No. Well, yes. Only Kane lied to me at first. He said it was down to stress and drinking too much. Why would he lie like that? Because, Moira, he's in denial. Well, at least I managed to get the truth out of him eventually. Look, he needs an operation, OK, and he needs one urgently, but because of the risks involved, he reckons he'll take his chances. Oh, back up a little. What are his chances? They're not good. And it's not a matter of if, it's when. That's why I'm hoping he will listen to you. Well, he'll listen all right. Or I'll drag him to that hospital. Come on. No, it's Kane, he's not breathing! Hi, yeah, uh, ambulance, please. Um, down at the Ford at Emmerdale Village. Can you hear me? It's uh, a body, we found it, it's floating in the lake. Where's Kane? Yeah, that's what I want to know. Dan? Go off. Well, where? Cafe, pub, Apollo space mission? It's a space shuttle these days, not Apollo. Really Although, I think of it, I think they've been that off as well. Oh, oh, slow down, Kieran. Well, what's he doing there? Right, I I'm on my way. What's happened? Kane's collapsed. Right, I'm going to ring Deb. Is he all right? I don't know. Kieran dragged him out of the water. I gave CPR, but he's breathing on his own now. Let's get a line in and an ECG. We need a temperature, it could be hypothermic. It's going to be okay though now. That CPR could have made all the difference. You want the job? Uh, I'm a vet. Okay. I'm his way. What's oh, happened? Can you... No, we just saw him in the water. Uh, there, there, there's something you need to know. He's got this uh, brain aneurysm. A what? It's a swelling in his brain. He's had it for a while. You knew? You knew and you haven't done it. I wanted to. I am sorry. He's not going to die, is he? No, he's going to be fine. Is, is it OK if we go with him? At charity, will you follow? <laughs> Thank you. You'll be all right. Come on. 